FC. All right, take a look at this. Lightning was the star of the show that Mother Nature put on last night across our area. A real stunner here in Robinson, right near the Chartiers Country Club. And I was hearing the thunder last mm -hmm. night, certainly hearing the wind, too. Mm -hmm. Like, this was powerful. And Ron called it. He yeah. said exactly whenever it was going to move through, and that's what happened. And you had to have been concerned about the trees, too, Ron, because of the saturated ground that we have. Yeah, and we saw a couple of uh, shots there, some trees coming down as well. Just be aware, even though that this came in around 8, 8.30, 9 o'clock, there could still be some branches out there on some of those roads, so be aware of that. As you're starting off, things are starting to brighten up right now. Still have about 30 minutes to go a little bit less than that for sunrise temperature right now. It's 59. Look at the winds are out of the west at 12 miles an hour. I actually have those winds at just uh, about 5 to 10 miles an hour today, so they're a little stronger than that at this point. Dew point coming in at 50 degrees. I was just looking our temperatures right now uh, about 5 to 10 degrees cooler at this point than they were just 24 hours ago. That puts Pittsburgh coming in at 59 degrees. Butler <clears throat> at 56 in Washington at 58. It's 57 in Greensburg. You'll notice it's cloudy out there this morning. We will see some sunshine today. The later into the day we go, uh, the better the chance to see some sunshine. So we'll call it mostly cloudy this morning. I still think there's going to be some peaks out there of some sun this morning. We'll call it mostly sunny for the afternoon. We'll kind of split the difference, call it partly cloudy for the day. Here's your forecast. How we get there 1 o'clock 65, just a high of 72 today. Yesterday we hit 82 degrees. Second day in a row we hit that 80 degree mark and it was also uh, when you're looking at 80 degrees the third time this week and this year <clears throat> that we had hit that uh, 80 degree mark. 7 o'clock temperature coming in at 70 degrees. Here's those highs today. Mid to low 70s most places, especially from Beaver County to the south. If you're north of there, you might struggle just to get back to the 70 degree mark, but it's going to be close. Chances for rain, they're going up tomorrow morning. Not expecting a lot in the way of any storm chances. So here's radar now. I'll zoom out. I'll show you the rain moving away from us. It's moving out of New York at this point. And then you can see both the clear skies and tomorrow morning's rain. Looks pretty nasty right now as it's heading our way, but tomorrow morning, I'm only expecting rain showers for the most part, maybe on the leading edge, a rumble or two, but nothing severe from this. We're looking at about a fifth of an inch of rain overall coming in. That's going to add to these uh, big totals that we've already seen. We are right now the third wettest April uh, that we see. Now, I'm not going to say on record anymore because our top number, I believe 1951, officially happened. I believe we're at eight uh, more than eight inches of rain there. Uh, actually more than nine inches of rain there that happened before records were being kept in 1951. So we'll say just uh, that we have. It looks like it's the third wettest uh, that the National Weather Service recognizes. 71 your high temperature today, 68 your Friday high temperatures dropping in the afternoon and we'll be in the 50s for highs Saturday and on Sunday.